So I got my food bag here. I crammed in there. Five days worth of food here. In the food bag. It's all separate so I can pull that up in a tree if I need to, to keep animals out of it at night. I mean this is my entire my entire cook kit here. It all fits kind of down in this little small bag. And then I, I've made made myself a pop koozie, which most people do, and I can tell why it actually works really well for cooking. That way you don't have to burn fuel the entire time you're cooking. And it also makes a great pot holder when you're done. You can actually hold this while you're eating so you're not burning your hands. So it's actually really nice and it's really light. It only probably weighs maybe one ounce, maybe two. Cook kit. I got one of the Tokes 650 milliliter titanium pots. And I've got one of the BRS 3000 stoves. Mini bit lighter. Pot, the little pot koozie kind of handy. You can put some of your loose items in there so you don't lose them while you're, while you're doing lunch. Got the small canister fuel, which actually fits right down inside of the, fits right down in the stove. So it's actually kind of handy. I've actually got about 30, I keep track of it on here, 31, so far I've gotten 31 plus cups of boil. You know, and some of those cups I actually let simmer and boil for, for a little while. So I've actually gotten quite a bit of time out of that. On my five day hike, this is all I'm going to bring is just the one canister. It's going to be, it's going to be plenty enough for me to, for me to actually cook for one week, especially if I only do, you know, hot meals maybe in the evening. So out here, it's probably a challenge to find a good flat spot. Do that. Unpackage some of my food bag here. So I guess one advantage of your food is every day you hike, your, your pack's gonna get a little bit smaller, lighter. But I've actually got cereal uh, for a couple of the mornings. So it's cereal with some powdered milk. So basically I'll just, I'll just add some water and shake this up. Good to go. There's another cereal. It's a, it's a double helping of cereal. So it's uh, 16, I'll add 16 ounces of water to that. I've actually tried that, it's pretty good. Got some trail mix. Those are for snacks during the day on the hike. And then I got a sweet and salty mix. Not much calories at all to this. This is miso soup. Uh, it's just kind of a good pick me up for me. Really good. I love miso. It's just a, I think I could eat a helping of two of this with the meal. And it's just, it's just really nice. Kind of a nice little side item. I brought, olive oil two different reasons it adds a lot of calories to the food and it really to me i think it adds a lot of you know a lot of taste to it that i like as well as the salt so we're burning through a lot of sodium so i'll, I'll say it's healthy maybe other people would argue argue that but salt really adds a lot of flavor to my meals peanut butter is just kind of a, a hiking staple because it's loaded with calories so kind of another another day snack um, got Thanks. some of these uh, Nescaf toasters choice coffee got five of those for morning time uh, for my hot meals I get to choose I've got a few of these I got Parmesan fettuccine pasta cheeky cheesy bacon macaroni uh, another one of the Parmesan cheddar broccoli pasta and then also the alternate from my breakfast meals is I got three different flavor of oatmeal so each morning I'll do two packets for a breakfast so with a breakfast I can also do those those are apple and cinnamon brown maple and sugar and then I got cinnamon spice just that way I'm not eating the exact same thing every meal every morning and then I've got one just mountain house I've had for a while. It's a lasagna meal. 
So that's a dry meal. That, that one's ready to go. That's pretty nice. I've got, actually brought some protein here. They're not super light, but they're 2.6 ounces. So I brought one packet a day that I could mix in with some of the cooked meal. So I got zesty lemon pepper, herb and garlic, and I really like salmon. I don't, I've never tried this packaged salmon, so we'll see how that goes. I'm sure it's not as good as the, the uh, salmon fillets. And then for the trail snacks, got brought a Snickers for every day. That seems to be a, a staple for hiking. And then again, just the, more of the coffee. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep the camera rolling here, but I'm gonna, this is gonna be all fast forward from here as we cook.